Once upon a time, a dragonfly buzzed around the community, and boy was it a disingenuous dragonfly, nodding its head, agreeing with everyone, understanding everything, but behind those facades, it had as much comprehension as a tumbleweed in a Shakespearean play. The dragonfly pretended to avoid conflict, but only managed to erect a great wall of genuine communication and trust. This might stem from a fear of confrontation, a desire to be liked, or an aversion to awkward conversations, but it makes the dragonfly about as authentic as a unicorn in a police lineup. Now let's compare this with the open otter. The open otter doesn't just nod along to the beat. No, sir. The otter is always honest, clear, and unafraid to ask questions. Sorry, can you explain that again? Or I disagree, but I'd love to understand your perspective. A common otter phrase is, this makes them more real than reality TV and about as trustworthy as a nun in a candy store. If you come across a disingenuous dragonfly, here's what you might say. I appreciate your agreement, but I value your genuine thoughts and feelings more. Let's be open with each other, let's all strive to be more like the open otter. Dear dragonflies, authenticity is like a rare gem in today's world, precious, valued, and far better than any masquerade. So toss off those masks and wear your genuine selves with pride. After all, who needs a dragonfly when you can be a darn good otter? <laughs> Yeah.